Hello friends, it's been over a year since I've made a video, but here I am back to show you some more information. It's November 2nd, and that means we're about four weeks away from this year's Black Friday deals. So I thought today we'd go back, look at 2022 and last year's Black Friday sales to see kind of what was on sale, what you might want to save up for. You got four weeks to do it, and we're going to check that out. So let's start with 2022. We had content on sale. We had some goodies on sale. 85% off Sharn, 60% off Feywild, 25% off Saltmarsh. Again, this is in the DDO market specifically, so you have to use real money to get it. But if you're new to the game, if you maybe only have the DDO free quest code, um, this is a great time to pick up some of these expansions. You know, you can get Sharn, Feywild, and Saltmarsh for under $40. So if you got some extra money, I think it's pretty good. Even if you have the Sharn Basic, the Ultimate Edition for $19.50 to get the boarding pass, lets you teleport the Sharn, lets you teleport to Vecna area. Um, I think that's pretty good. 2022, they also had the Universal Action Point Tome on sale. They had an Iconic Hero on sale, the Asimar Scourge, and they had Wishes for Memories on sale. Some kind of neat stuff. Excuse me. Let's jump up to 2023. A lot of the same sales, but some different items. Sharn was still 85% off, but you had the chance to finally get the expansion trove for 85% off for just $9. You can get the Mist of Ravenloft, the Way Moon Prison uh, expansion, and the kind of Evening Star main quest. So, like the main chain C1, C2, C3 and then some of the side quests. So if you don't have that, pick it up, it's a good deal. 60% off Feywild was the same, but now it's a 50% off Salt Marsh, so only $10 just to get the adventure pack, which I know a lot of people don't like, but I like playing at level three. I think it's cool, I think it feels classic. Music is awesome. Uh, so yeah, if you need some content, we expect all of that to come back. And we'll talk about kind of what is on our wish list what's hopeful for this year last year also on sale was the traveler's terrific trunk you can see all of it includes there on the side five sovereign one xp boosts you get some major sawyer boosts get some mysterious remnant boosts um, and you get 100 ast astral shards so for less than a thousand ddo points it's pretty good I would definitely pick that up if that's going to be on sale again this year. They had 50% off plus eight tomes, so a thousand DDO points for one or 2,800 for all six for the Supreme Tome. If you don't have plus eight tome on all your characters, or I say on your main character <laughs> for all your stats, and you got the points, it's a pretty good pickup. Last year, they also had 35% off the Heroic and Epic Learning Tomes. There's an example on the side there, but basically you get a big, chunky, first-time XP bonus for running the quest, and then you get, like, another little bit permanent bonus every time you rerun it. So there's a heroic version that works from 1 through 20, and then there's an epic version from 20 to 30. So those are really good for, like, permanent XP boost. Maybe you're finally on your third life. Maybe you finally have to deal with the massive... XP that you need per reincarnation, and that's a great way to kind of catch back up. During Black Friday, they also um, give you the opportunity to get more bonus points when you purchase DDO points in the store, and then the heroic, epic, and improved autos boxes are usually back around for a limited time. So there's an example of there. They are very expensive. I don't buy them because I never have enough points for that, but maybe you're a VIP, you have a lot of DDO points sitting in the bank, and that's a pretty good investment, to be honest. It's got a little bit of everything. XP, XP Elixir, Slayer Boost. Um, the improved one has Great Art Elixirs of Discovery, which is pretty nice. Some Siberius Cakes. And then a little bit of Astro Shards, so you can pick those up. I know people will pick those up in the store and then put them on the auction house for an insane amount of Astro Shards, but, you know, teach their own. So what are we hoping for this year, 2024? Well, I would expect the same content to still be on sale. We'll still have 85% off Shard and probably the expansion trove. 
probably 60% off Feywild. It'd be nice if they bumped that up to 85, but whatever. 50% off Salt Marsh, yeah. It's probably about the same. People have been waiting for Isle of Dread to go on sale. Uh, I think a pretty wonderful adventure pack. Fun quests, um, great loot, um, end game weapon crafting that's like stupid easy. Um, bones, if you just want to get more astral shards for your main character, you can just farm the bones and then sell them on the auction house. Uh, I think that's great. So people are waiting and clamoring for Isle of Dread to go on sale. At least 25% off would be nice. They had it on sale, not like for Black Fridays, but like random points of the year, they had it on sale for 25% off at some point. So like it should be coming around. That's what we all hope for. If the Traveler's Terrific Trunk goes on sale again for 75% off, I highly recommend picking it up because, again, a lot of XP boosts, Slayer boosts, so when you're trying to get 20 for 30, you're doing the Slayers, you're doing Orchard, um, getting 200% per kill, it's pretty nice. So yeah, let me know down in the comments what you would like to see in DDO sales, kind of wish something that should go on sale and what you've been waiting for what would be great so yeah let me know let's chat it up otherwise thanks for coming around thanks for sticking by i'll see you in game sometime take care bye